All right, so first of all, I apologize because you probably will see reflections in the screen of this tool. Um, but we're gonna be doing a proper video on this uh, quite soon, actually. Uh, but we've just kind of received our first batch of these tools. And uh, this will maybe excite or sort of pique the attention of any McLaren owner or anybody who kind of works on McLaren vehicles. Um, we've, um, we've got the Autel uh, tool, which will work on the McLaren cars. Uh, we'll pop the link to this kit in the description below this video. Uh, we're quite excited about this actually because, you know, for many years, McLaren owners and anyone who kind of works on McLaren cars has had really nothing to use on their vehicles. Uh, well, this kind of changes that. And I'm going to kind of show you just some basic screens, nothing too in-depth and too much detail, trying to get the best kind of like angle on this so it's not showing too many reflections. Um, but what we'll do is we'll go into the McLaren icon here um, and we're going to go I'll just click on cancel oh, we're going to go standalone diagnostics there there we go just click ok there. we're just going to bypass all of the uh, the kind of the main uh, screens that you will come across because we're not kind of in a real world situation here so we're kind of just trying to get into the tool and show you like the vehicle selection okay so we'll go manual selection and then on the left hand side here it's going to give us a list of all the the mclaren cars that it will cover so as you can see we've got the coupe the spider 675lt 650s uh coupe and spider 625 625c coupe and spider 575LT, GTR, 570S, 540C, 570S, Coupe and Spider, 540C, Coupe and Spider, GT, 720S, Coupe and Spider, whoops, uh, Senna, Senna GDR, 600LT, Coupe and Spider. Again, I apologize for the, uh, the reflections on the screen here. But let's see, for example, we have just as a, a, a use of uh, for the video 675LT and let's say we have like a 2016 model so it's going to give us some basic information and then we've got this screen here so you can do an automatic scan of the whole vehicle you can either choose which control unit you wish to do or the hot functions. Uh, we'll come to those in a second. We're not going to use the auto scan because we're not actually connected to a vehicle. So we're going to click on to control unit. And this is basically a list of all of the systems that the tool can connect to within this McLaren. OK, and yes, it does also depend on what is actually installed to that vehicle. But in this case, um, we're looking at things like engines, the powertrain control module, the ESP, electronic stability, occupant restraints, instrument cluster, electronic park and brake, body control. Uh, it's, so it's going to do like your ABS, your airbags, your seats. Um, and it's got quite a good level of coverage um, for McLaren because bearing in mind, we've been used to having absolutely nothing for McLaren for a good few years. So it's going to do the engines, going to do the transmission. Uh, it's going to do the ABS, the airbags, electronic park and brake clusters, and, and all the other things that you see on screen here. Okay, so those are those are classes like the systems that it will cover. Um, if we just click back here, then I'm going to show you the hot functions. So these are classes like service functions, um, and it'll do the oil service reset and the electronic park and brake. So generally. Uh, the rear brakes will need to be, if, you, if you're changing the pads or the discs, you need to open the caliber with the diagnostic tool. This tool will do it, which is very good news. And then we, we just going to click back from this. I wanted to go into the screen whereby it'll show us the other vehicles. Uh, no manual selection. Ah, here we go. So yeah, so like just as an example 720s let's say spider uh let's say 2018 just completely randomizing uh control unit so you might get a different level of coverage depending on the vehicle that it's in so this one here you can see it's got a few more bits and bobs that i can uh, do when it comes to system wise and if we go to hot functions we've got three here Oil reset, electronic park and brake, 
and that would be electronic throttle calibration okay so um, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna pop the link to this in the description we will be making a proper sort of more dedicated video on this we just really wanted to show you the tool um, kind of straight out of the box uh, we, we, we've got a lot of, uh, sort of cables and equipment inside that box as well which it all kind of comes with so just really wanted to show you that that is the like that's kind of what you get the main box um, the hard carry case with a lot of cables in and then obviously the unit the uh, the scan tool itself but I'll pop the link to this in the description because I, I imagine people may well be watching this um, even after we do the proper dedicated video so yeah thanks very much for watching guys and um, pleased really pleased to have a, a McLaren tool on board